Hello Vikings and welcome back to another Assassin's Creed Valhalla video. In this episode we are gonna go through the 5th of July 2022 Reda selection. And boom, it is looking awesome. Crescent Moon, Divine Pyridax, it is our first item, aka the daily. Put your targets to sleep on the next light attack hit after reaching the max tax. So definitely useful during the assassination challenges. But for now, let's move on to our first weekly item, and it is gonna be the Jormungandar helmet. The second item, Hulfolk blade, and both of these items are 120 opals for one week. So, already a gear piece and a weapon. The third item will be the sunlight, the white lion mount from the newest pack. Also, we are getting another weapon pack item, so thundering edge from the Thunderer weapons, and we are gonna actually use this one, increasing critical damage when using it. Also, again, we are having the Dwarven Axe, the Divine Dane Axe, so 200 Axe for 120 Opals, and yeah, that leaves us with only one decoration item, the Weeping Willow for 35 Opals. So, actually this is not that bad, and like I said in my live stream, from scale 1 to 10, I'm giving this solid 8.5 so pretty awesome new items never seen before items some older items and only one decoration so that is a huge thing at least for me so let me know in the comments down below what you think of this week and what you are gonna get from reda if anything it is time to highlight some best items from this week and of course the sunlight the mount that is absolutely beautiful also the thundering edge, really cool lighting effect. Also the handle, it is pretty interesting on this weapon as we can see. Also the design, I like it, but totally understand why some of you may disagree with me on this one. On the other hand, the Jormungandar helmet, it is pretty scary. <laughs> Let's be honest. The snakes, broken looking golden helmet. Not bad, not bad. But the best thing about the Jormungandar set it is the two set perk increased damage taken by 25%, increased melee damage when equipped. The bonus for that one it is whopping 65 melee damage. Moving on to the Thundering Edge. So this weapon. Increased critical damage when in combat, bonus decreases the longer you remain in combat until the minimum bonus is reached. Cooldown is triggered when exiting the combat. Stacks 4 times, duration 10 seconds, cooldown 20 seconds, bonus is plus 40 to 10 critical damage. Here is a quick look for the Hulfolk blade, but moving on to the testing, but before that we have to try with this lion also to scare our enemies. Sadly, it is not working. And if you are wondering how I'm doing this, on the PlayStation I'm only pressing square, only once while I'm mounted, and it should be doing that one. Not sure what it is for PC or Xbox. But if you do, please let us know in the comments down below how you can do that on the PC or the Xbox. But yeah, the armor set, the two set perk from the Jormungandr one, and I'm having another two set perk from the Wayland's armor, so some of our assassination damage is converted to melee damage. I'm using in this video the Gilded Edge from the last week and the Thundering Edge from this week. And yeah, I am actually amazed how much damage I'm doing with the two short shorts, I mean 50, 60, 70, even up to plus 200. So that is pretty, pretty amazing in my opinion. Really good weapons, pretty awesome week. What you think, let me know in the comments down below. But before ending this video, I really want to thank all of my channel members who have supported the channel way beyond. So thank you Elite Wolfpack. And if you want to be part of the Elite Wolfpack with different perks like custom emojis, early access to some of my videos and much more, there is a join button below this video. But yeah, let's take a couple more looks of the kills. 
And did you see by the way? There was decapitation with two swords, that was awesome. But for now, let's roll the outro. Thanks for watching. Remember to hit the like, hit the sub, turn on the notifications so you won't ever miss anything that I upload or when I go live. Also Vikings, have fun, stay safe, be strong, hope to see you in the next one. Skatha, over and up and bye bye.